Good afternoon, everybody. Thank you so much for being on today's webinar. Uh, the topic of today's webinar is behind the scenes of six-figure membership website, and I am super excited to show you uh, what we have done with this six-figure membership website. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for being with me today uh, for a webinar uh, behind the scenes of a six-figure membership website. I am very excited about uh, this opportunity to share with you uh, everything that we have done in the last uh, two years to build and manage a membership website that actually create the six-figure income for my client, Davey. Uh, so let's get started. And if you have any questions, uh, feel free to put them into the chat box uh, anytime during the meeting. And also, if you are seeing this recording after the webinar is ended, uh, feel free to put questions uh, in the box below. And I come here very often and will answer any questions that you may have uh, so that you are clear on how this has all been done. Uh, so this is what you are about to discover, uh, what the monthly membership program looks like. You might have heard about Mom's membership websites before and how uh, they are so great to create uh, passive income and so on. So uh, how does it really look like? Uh, we'll um, give you some insight. Uh, what the technical challenges are on the way to implementing a system that is robust and actually work. Uh, how choosing the right tools can make the implementation easy and robust, and how you too can have a system like that. Uh, this is for you if you want to make money online, even when you sleep. If you are ready to create a membership site to leverage your time and make money and to leverage your knowledge and reach uh, more people. And if you are up for playing a bigger game and when I mean a bigger game is basically, I mean, when you are ready to actually uh, move forward with an online program and give it all it takes to make it successful. Uh, because the tools that I'm going to share with you today are a bit more expensive than uh, a free, uh, free tools that are available out there in the market and um, and require investment of time and, and expertise. So um, that's why I'm saying that. Now, who am I and why you should listen to me? So my name is Michelle Castillo. I am a mechanical engineer by profession. I'm a technology geek. I love technology. I love helping uh, people bring their, uh, their uh, programs uh, into life and to market. For many, many years, I work in the corporate world as a software development manager, uh, and I have been building membership websites and many other types of web MM websites since 2011. So I've seen a lot of things. I've seen the technology evolve, and I'm really excited about how the technology is today. Uh, it gives us a lot of um, flexibility, and uh, for me, it's fun. Uh, today we are going to look into the mem membership website of Dave D. He's been my client for over two years and we have done a lot of work together. Uh, this is Dave's homepage. Uh, this is not the membership website, but that's where it all starts. Uh, because in order to have an online program, uh, you need audience, you need contacts, you need people that really want to learn from you. And for Dave, it starts here, where he invites people to get a free gift, which is um, um, an ebook or, or presentation that they ask for, uh, and, and they, they need to give their email. And what happens next is that they uh, get into his uh, CRM system, which is Infusionsoft, and they, he, they get promotion emails that encourage them to use uh, his membership, uh, to become subscribers of his membership website, or to buy other courses that he offers. Um, 
Today, we are mostly going to focus on the membership website that Dave offers, uh, which is called the Inner Sanctum VIP. It's a monthly membership uh, plan. And this is a screenshot from Dave's website, uh, from the resources page, uh, where uh, there's a list of all the programs he offers. And um, if you click on this button, I just took a screenshot uh, of a much longer sales page just to give you an idea of what's included in this uh, membership uh, program. So every month they record a masterclass, which is about one hour video uh, teaching people how to sell more uh, to their audience. He mostly works with um, financial advisors, lawyers, uh, uh, other service providers uh, that uh, that want more clients. Uh, then there is a live uh, coaching call where people can hop on on a tele uh, tele seminar kind of platform and ask questions and get answers. There is also uh, every month he delivers um, a template uh, for an email um, campaign. Uh, every month there is a different topic to it. He often uh, uh, uses um, this specific month's kind of uh, holiday or events to help people uh, use that as a topic for, for their campaigns. And there's also um, a printed uh, email and a printed newsletter that goes uh, via snail mail every month. And there is a Facebook group. Uh, People pay $97 to be part of this membership program. And, uh, <clears throat> and uh, what we have done is we have built the whole back end to enable the delivery of, of all this beautiful and interesting content. So this is a, a list of the main tasks uh, from a technology point of view that needs to, we needed to handle and uh, just to give you an idea of uh, what uh, we need to achieve. So the subscription process where people uh, say, yes, I want that. They provide their credit card and they uh, become members. They get an email with the, uh, their login information and they are automatically being charged every month. Uh, so there is that. And then uh, situations where the credit card fails for some reason, and uh, if someone wants to cancel. Um, and of course, uh, it's not listed here, but everything has to do with actual delivery of the content. Um, so uh, just to give you an overview of the tools that we have used, uh, we're using WordPress uh, as the platform where the, the content is, um, is um, embedded. And then we're using Memberium, which is a WordPress plugin that helps us control the access to the content on the website. Uh, and uh, this uh, Memberium plugin integrates with Infusionsoft, which is the CRM. And we're going to see how that works. Uh, in a few seconds. And just to make, to give you an idea of how great Memberium is, uh, so it's the same tool that is used by Tony Robbins and Dean Graciosi to launch their Knowledge Business Blueprint program that costs a few thousands of dollars, uh, which they have released a few months ago. Uh, we also use Infusionsoft. That tool is being used by Tony Robbins, I am pretty sure. And, uh, Infusionsoft is the CRM, which manages all the contacts, and it also uh, allows us to process credit cards and manage the, the permission uh, for people to access the content and so on. We will uh, pretty soon go and look into the actual Infusionsoft and the website to see how it all works together. So if it's not clear yet, bear with me for a second and we are going to get there. On the WordPress um, side, we also use the Thrive Theme and Thrive Architect to actually build those web pages and uh, arrange the content. 
uh, Thrive Architect is an amazing tool that allows you to build pages and move things around uh, in and what you see is what you get environment that I absolutely love. We use it for most of the website we build uh, for our clients, be it a membership website or any other website. Uh, so before we go into looking at the website itself and at Infusionsoft, I want to clear uh, one concept which is super important uh, to understand how the whole system is working. And this is tags. So tags are like sticky notes and like sticky notes that you can put inside the CRM. So if you have a contact, you can assign to them tags that say, uh, whatever you want, basically. It could be tags that um, classify them according to uh, stuff they have purchased from you or uh, events they attended or interests that you are aware that they're interested in uh, and so on. In Infusionsoft, uh, you can assign uh, an unlimited amount of tags for every contact, so they can tags can be used in different ways. And by the way, tags are also used by a lot of the other CRM systems out there, uh, just to name a few, Ontraport, uh, ActiveCampaign, Drip, ConvertKit, um, and that's what I remember right now. So tags play a major role in our system, and uh, there are three function, main functions that I want to mention here. One is the ability to organize the contact, so basically to segment them. For example, uh, in the context of a membership website, we can tag everybody who is a member. And if we have a membership announcement, we can uh, use this tag to segment the, the entire database into only those people that are members and then send an email to those people. Uh, tags are also used as star triggers. Uh, this is a little bit harder to understand. Uh, we what it means is that when a certain contact gets a new tag, it can be the trigger for the beginning of an email sequence or any other um, sequence. And we are soon going to look and see that inside Infusionsoft. And finally, in uh, this specific system, uh, the tags are used to control the permission to access the content on the website. So um, we will see the example how it all works uh, in a minute. Uh, just to give an idea how Memberium works, um, Member uh, the way it works is that uh, people sign up, they may put their credit card in, uh, the contact is, uh, is pushed into Infusionsoft and then the website, uh, the, the Infusionsoft communicate with the website, creates a user and and a password, and then an email is being sent to the new member uh, with all this information. Uh, here is another schematic description of how it works. Uh, and the same system can also be used for, for free, um, for free access to, it doesn't have to be a credit card. So it can be someone puts their email and name, uh, it's being pushed into the Infusionsoft. Infusionsoft communicates with the website via the Memberium plugin, uh, creates the new user. Uh, Memberium gives Infusionsoft back the username and, and password, and Memberium can send that to uh, the new uh, member. The same happens if someone actually pays with a credit card. Uh, credit cards, in this case, are being processed inside Infusionsoft. So Infusionsoft um, can control the whole process. If someone's uh, credit card fails, it's something that Infusionsoft knows how to handle, but you, of course, have to configure it. And that was one thing that we had to do when we put all this system together. Uh, so this is actually my cue to move over and show you the actual website and how it looks like. So let's go to my browser and um, let's take a look. So um, this is the members area for the Inner Sanctum. 
as you can see, it's very simple design. Uh, we plan to make it a little bit more sophisticated in the future, but uh, this works perfectly. Uh, this, the program started in March 2018, and every month has its uh, content, as I mentioned before. There were also a few bonuses that were promised to the, to the new subscribers, and they are available here. Every um, month has its own web page. Uh, there is a video here that is the master class and also all the resources such as the slides and audio version of the master class for those people who want to download the audio and and walk around the park and listen to it. Uh, the sales search campaign, which is a template for for uh, email campaign that, that the members can use and also an electronic version of the printed newsletter that goes uh, via snail mail. Um, so let me show you a little bit how this page is being handled behind the scene. Uh, and for that, I'm going to launch the uh, Thrive Architect editor. And you can see here uh, something that you couldn't see at the front end, and these are uh, what is called in WordPress short code. This is just a little piece of code that is a memberium kind of piece of code. And what we see here is that every month is being protected by uh, making sure that only someone who has tag ID, and this is the tag ID, uh, has access to that. So this tag ID is something that I have to extract from Infusionsoft and the tag name inside Infusionsoft is Inner Sanctum December 2019. And every month's session has uh, a specific tag and so people who do not have this tag cannot see this content. Um, let's go back to the to the page itself, and uh, I want to dig into uh, the individual pages and show you more here. So these pages are not actually, if, if I uh, edit this with Thrive Architect, we do not use the tags in the same way, uh, because if someone already has access to this page, they can see everything. However, it is Memberium that gives us access to, uh, or if there is uh, there are options at the back end of this page, and this is if you know WordPress, this is the page editor of WordPress. Uh, we can define here that people can access this page if they are members of this Dave D in a Sanctum VIP, and if they have this specific tag. And here you can also see the name of the tag. It's Inner Sanctum Membership, December 2019, and the ID is uh, 1527. So, as you can see, Memberium gives us uh, different ways to protect content, and you have seen two of them. One of them is that uh, on a pair page, and it can also be a pair post level, and also you can uh, uh, provide permission to parts of the website using the shortcodes. Uh, now, let's hop to Infusionsoft and see how uh, this all works on the Infusionsoft side. Uh, so inside Infusionsoft, uh, we have, um, maybe I'll go one step backwards and I want to show you the beginning of the process. So let's say someone comes here and wants to buy, uh, to, to learn more about Inner Sanctum. There is a very long sales page here. You are more than welcome to go to the page and read it. It's very well written. And then when they say that they want to join, they have two options, the monthly membership and a yearly option, which we have recently added. And when they click on the join now option, that's when they are redirected to an order form. And this is something that is already on the Infusionsoft side. So basically this is a, uh, where they enter their name and emails, and most important, the credit card information, they have to accept the terms and condition and the privacy policy. And once they 
um, say they click on this button, their credit card is being processed. And there is a series of actions that happen inside Infusionsoft. So <coughs> this is the Infusionsoft campaign builder. And now we are looking at uh, the Infusionsoft uh, campaign that takes care of everything that has to do with the Inner Sanctum VIP membership. So i try to give you an overview of how it all works. If you've never seen Infusionsoft, uh, it might be, it might look strange to you, but uh, I really love this campaign builder. It is, in my opinion, much stronger than anything out there in the market today because it gives you a really good overview of what happens. So these, uh, all these circles here are actually actions that will initiate uh, the sequences that are coming uh, right after here. Uh, for example, uh, if you see this with the symbol of cart, this is actually what happens after someone uh, processes their credit card. They have purchased the Dave D in a Sanctum VIP and they are going into this sequence. Let's see what happens inside this sequence. So inside here, we are applying two tags. One is the membership tag. This is what um, controls the access inside the website. This is how Memberium knows that someone is an actual member. And uh, this is a tag that indicates that this uh, person is an active member of the Inner Sanctum VIP membership program. Uh, the next thing that happens is that we communicate with Memberium by using uh, something that is called HTTP POST. I'm just gonna show you in the inside just that you understand it's not very complicated. Uh, it's just one URL that Memberium gives us in the, inside the WordPress website. And uh, we just do that and it does the work. And what it does is uh, it, um, it uh, triggers the website to create a new user and to manufacture a password. And these two are being sent back to, uh, to the website or to Infusionsoft so that we can then send an email with all this information. Uh, we also wait here for two minutes just to make sure that the whole thing is, um, is completed before uh, this email is being sent. And in the email, and I'm sure you've seen emails such as this one uh, before, there is a whole, uh, there is a welcome message, then there is the login information, a lot of information on what to expect, and now everything works. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's it. So when somebody, when somebody signed up, they get this email, and now they have access to the content and the bonuses. So that takes care of uh, the first task, which is taking care of uh, subscribing people to the membership website. Um, just wanted to mention one thing here, uh, which is a feature that uh, is not easy to do with other systems if you don't have Infusionsoft or a similar system. Uh, we have, as I mentioned before, we've recently added a yearly subscription. And with yearly subscription, one of the challenges is that you do want to let people know that their subscription is about to be renewed in case they do not want to renew. It is a higher cost. It is $970 for the year. And a year from now, someone might forget that uh, this charge is coming up. So you want to let them know. And using, um, Infusionsoft, what we actually do is first we store the end date somewhere. Uh, we could implement it as a delay too, but I prefer to keep the actual date somewhere just in case uh, something happens in the middle, in meanwhile. And here uh, we wait until seven days before uh, the <clears throat> the membership is going to be renewed. We still don't have the email that is going to go out. We are going to implement it very soon because as I said, uh, it was just a few weeks ago that we started the, the yearly subscription. So uh, Dave has some time to create a copy. 
So this is about the initial setup of members. And this is what happens every month. So remember that in this sequence, we assigned a tag uh, that said that someone is active. Uh, let me show you that, this one, the inner sanctum VIP active. This is used, the, the fact that we assign someone the tag uh, use, used as a trigger to initiate this campaign here. And here, what you can see is that we have a series of action that takes part every month. So we wait for the uh, first day of the month. And then uh, what we do is uh, we assign a tag. So every month, as you've seen inside the website, we have a tag for every month. So we assign this tag, we communicate with the website to let the member you know now this tag is assigned to this member. And we send an email uh, telling people that the new MasterCard class is ready. As you can see here, we run that on the first of the month before between 12 p.m. and 11 p.m. What is the meaning of that? So let's say someone signs up at the first of the month at 1 p.m. Uh, they will still go through this process, which means that people have time to sign up until the end or almost the end of the first of the month to sign up in order to get access to this month's masterclass. Um, one of the rules that Dave has in place is that if you, if you are active in a certain month, you get access to the, this, is my, this month's uh, masterclass, but if you, if you cancel, then you no longer get access to future uh, masterclasses. Uh, and uh, the, yeah, so uh, that helps him uh, promote the program up until almost the end of the first of the month. Uh, now, what you can see here is how people are pulled out of this sequence. So in any case that someone has a credit card fails or if they cancel, uh, they, they have a tag that is applied, which is in a Sanctum VIP not active. In that case, they're pulled out of this uh, sequence and they don't get the, the access tag. Uh, which means that they don't get access to uh, following month's uh, content. And this is how we make sure that people get access only to months that they have uh, paid for. Uh, following, and I'm not going to go into all these, uh, there are uh, different uh, tasks that we take care of if um, if a credit card fails, for example, on the fourth, if a credit card fails, we, the system automatically tries four times to rerun it. And on the fourth time, uh, we send an email to the support team and they actually pick up the phone and call the member just to make sure that, um, that they really don't want, what do they want to do next? Do they want to use a different credit card or maybe uh, they want to cancel or whatever it is, but we don't want we want to deliver a good experience to those members and communication is a very important part of that. Um, for the cancellation, if someone wants to cancel, we have a special interface for the support team that enables them to easily enter someone's name and, and cancel uh, while leaving some trace in the system to make sure we know why uh, that happened. So this is about the Infusionsoft uh, side. Um, and yeah, so I would like to show you one more uh, program that is available in, the, in this website to give an idea of what happens if it, all you have is an online, uh, only online program that is not a membership uh, website. So let me find this program. So this is uh, just an, an eight weeks program. Uh, is an eight, yeah, eight weeks program. Uh, people sign up and every week they get an access to a new, uh, the new content. And uh, from a, 
organization point of view is very similar. So every week uh, we have the video, we have some, some uh, other resources. At the back end of every page, uh, we have uh, here, this, is the, this program has uh, a name. It, it actually, we originally got, call it that, but it doesn't matter, people do not see it at the front end. And the front end name has changed. Uh, and there's also a tag for every week. Now, if we look at the, the way we deliver that from the infusion point, infusion soft point of view, uh, we have a similar beginning. So people uh, purchase the program, but this is only a one-time payment. And then they, the same thing happens. They, they get a, a new member is created in the membership website. They get an email telling them how to access. And then every week, we assign this week's tag. So this one is week one. We send the information to the membership website. We send an email telling them that their weekly uh, class is ready. And then we wait uh, for one week. And this is when week two uh, starts. So, and it goes on like that for eight weeks. And then we, there is more actions that I, I do not want to discuss right now, but because it, but it's everything here is basically about implementing the rule of, of the program. So this program that people, it is an eight weeks program, but after they get one year access to the program. So once one year after they actually become inactive and um, they get an email that they have the, the ability to renew or something along that line. So that is um, about uh, how it's all being done. Uh, again, if you have any questions, please um, let me know. And if you're watching this recording after the fact, feel free to ask questions below uh, and I will come back and answer any questions that you may have. And um, yeah, now if you, this is just want to share with you what Dave D is thinking about our service. So I give you a second or two to read that. And uh, I wanted to invite you, I promised you that I'll tell you how you can also make it happen. So uh, if you are thinking about building your own membership website or online program and want to have a system that is robust, that will take care of all the aspects of running a membership website, all the way from uh, marketing to delivery to handling special situations, then uh, feel free to book a free consultation with me. Uh, the URL for the consultation is on the screen. I'm also going to edit under the video. Uh, so I'm looking forward to speak, talking to you. As I I really love helping people putting their online program into the te reality, the technology reality. So I look forward to hearing from you and I hope that you have learned something today. Have a great day.